بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم الحمد للہ رب العالمین و صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم علی نبی محمد و علی آلہ و صحبہ و سلم اما بعد اللہ تبارک و تعالی has created all of this beautiful, spacious, and vast earth. So many beautiful things to see, so many beautiful things to reflect upon in His creation. And these are considered ayat al kawniya These are ayat or, or signs in Allah, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created in His creation. Seeing the, the, the trees, the plants, even the weeds, the flowers, all of this, this beautiful, this beautiful creation, the sun, walhamdulillah, ni'ma azim. It's in fact, it's a ni'ma to even have another day to be above the ground, so to speak, meaning another time to reflect on Allah Subhanahu wa Taala's creation, another time to reflect on Allah. Use the creation as dalil, as evidence that your Lord Subhanahu wa Taala exists. And although we have our many, many shortcomings. And our many, many sins, we can all come back to Allah. We can all make tawbah to Allah. And tawbah is a type of ibadah. It's a type of worship. And mankind, all of mankind commits sins, as the Prophet ﷺ said, Kullu ibn Adam khatta wa khayran khatayina tawabun. All the children of Adam, they make mistakes or they commit sins. And the best of those who commit sin is those who repent. So we all make sins. But the best of us is those who repent. And of course the best of us, as there's no comparison, is the believers, Ahli Iman. However, a lot of His infinite grace, mercy, and favor makes, orders all of mankind to come to the worship of Him and Him alone. With no partners. Qala subhana, Ya ayu al-nas, Ya ayu al-nas يا أيها الناس اعبدوا ربكم الذي خلقكم والذين من قبلكم لعلكم تتقون الذي جعل لكم الأرض فراشا والسماء بناء وأنزل من السماء ماء فأخرج, فأخرج به من ثمرات رزق لكم فلا تجعلوا لله اندادا وأنتم تعلمون الله سبحانه وتعالى says in سورة البقرة he addresses all of mankind يا أيها الناس اعبدوا ربكم O oh, mankind, worship your Lord. Because Allah is our Lord. He's the Rabbil Alameen. He's the Lord of all things. The one who created you and those who came before you in order that you would gain God-fearfulness, meaning to have taqwa. Taqwa meaning that you would fear Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by doing His commandments and avoiding those things He has prohibited. He's the one, then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala expands in that same verse, Alladhi ja'ala lakum al-ard firashan. The one who made the earth as like a, a place of rest. Was sama and the skies, or in the sky, as, as, as a, a, a build or a fortress or a, a, a something to be built upon. Bina'in. وَأَنزَلَ مِنَ السَّمَاءِ And then he sends down from the sky. He sends down from the sky. مَاءٍ Meaning rain, water. فَأَخْرَجَ بِهِ مِنْ ثَمَرَاتِ رُزْقٍ لَكُمْ He sends down the rain to bring forth plants as we witness here. To bring forth flowers, to bring forth trees, to bring forth those things, those crops that we eat. فَأَخْرَجَ بِهِ مِنْ ثَمَرَاتِ رُزْقٍ لَكُمْ as a, as a provisions for you. فَلَا تَجْعَلُ لِلَّهِ Then Allah, after affirming all of those things that He does, subhanahu wa ta'ala, for His creation, out of His infinite grace, mercy, and favor, then He affirms after that, He orders us. فَلَا Or He prohibits us. فَلَا تَجْعَلُ لِلَّهِ Do not associate partners with Allah and dadin. وَأَنْتُمْ تَعْلَمُونَ And you know. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala prohibits that you worship other than Him, along with Him, and you have this knowledge. Meaning that you have knowledge that Allah created the heavens and earth, 
that he created the rains which bring forth uh, plants and provisions for us. You know all of this, and then you reject the law. Then you reject worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala properly. So we ask that Allah guides us to the worship of Him and Him alone and protects us from every kind of evil. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have mercy upon us and our parents and our families and guide all of our families to Islam for us who have non-Muslim families. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide all those people with Muslim families to the sunnah of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam that they're on firmness and strong, strong faith. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.